Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube marketing channel. I am your host Marlon and today I want to do this tutorial and it's how to remove a file or folder off your PC or your laptop that won't delete. And the reason for that a lot of times is you may maybe transfer that file or folder to somewhere else and now I mean all you have it seems like a ghost file but in apprentices I mean if you do try to click in and try to delete it obviously you won't go anywhere. And I know you might be experiencing the same problem, hence you watching this video. So I'm going to try to click in this one and obviously it have item not found and you know, you try to again, I guess, and nothing happens and pretty much the same thing will happen with these six folders. So the best way how to get rid of it is pretty much go into your start menu and then you're going to type in this code, which is CMD. And if you maybe an Windows H or something like lower than that, I mean, you might have an EXE file um, in that file. So from now I'm on Windows 10, so you're gonna have just only command prompt. So you're gonna click in that, and it's gonna give you this um, kind of black box here, and this is where you're gonna do the magics. So I'm gonna just kind of expand this a little bit so we can see what we're pretty much doing here. So you're gonna have your username of your computer or your PC, whatever that you may be using right now. So all you have to do now is to type in this piece of code, and it is CD, forward slash D space capital C and then you're going to have colon then afterwards you're going to put in um, um, backward slash now and then users and then you're going to put in your username after you put backslash sorry backslash so mine is um, Alexius so whatever your name is of your uh, PC you're going to put in that name and mine is going to be Alexia like I said Alexia which is not me, that's my wife's name. And um, after that, you're gonna have um, another forward slash again, and then you're gonna you know, direct it to exactly where the folder is. Mine, as you can see, is on the desktop. I don't know if, if yours may be in a desktop or somewhere else, then you can direct it to that place. So mine is gonna be desktop. And then afterwards, I'm gonna go ahead and press enter. And then you're gonna give me another opportunity to add a, another piece of code. This time you're going to be DIR, and then afterwards you're going to have forward slash, then X for X ray, then enter. And these are all of the folders or file that I may have right now running on my desktop. So we need to look for these six, or pretty much one of them for now as a demonstration. So there's a next piece of code that I want you guys to add as well, and it is um, RM, I think RM DIR. And then you're gonna have forward slash Q, and then forward slash again, S, and then a bit of space. And now all you're gonna see now, you're gonna have all of your folder on the right hand side, and then you're gonna have a code, which I guess this is a code of the folder now, okay, they recorded right now. So this is how I guess your PC, your laptop, we're gonna read these folders. So now we need to look for the name of these ones. So I have profit, um, trading profits. So if I could see that one, trading profits. So this is right here. So the how to get rid of this, I, I need to put this piece of code down here now. So, and this needs to be in capital. As you can see, all of these are in capital. So let's see if this does work. <laughs> so we got trading, uh, so okay, so T-R-A-D. I N only, I guess. And um, then you're gonna have that little scribble, so you need to put a little scribble. I don't know what you call it, you can leave it in the comment section. And then you have number one. And then um, all I'm gonna do now is to hit um, enter and see what happens if the magic do happens. And as I can see clearly, it disappears. And if we need to get um, the same cycle repeated again, if you have a number of folders, you can pretty much repeat the same process. So that's how quick and easy you can get rid of those files. So you're gonna repeat, I don't wanna bore you with all this, um, getting rid of these six. So you're gonna repeat the same cycle by placing in the RMDIR forward slash Q forward slash S and whatever the name of your coded folder, you're gonna just associate that um, next um, um, beneath this and then you're gonna go ahead and pretty much if you have maybe 10 maybe five folders I myself got six so just gonna repeat the same cycle and get rid of maybe pretty much all of your folders which is affecting your desktop itself or anywhere else maybe on your PC or your laptop so like I said this is a quick easy way to get rid of it without any 
like I said, problem causing from you doing other things. So like I said, if you like this video, please like and share and subscribe to my channel for more videos and how to's and also YouTube marketing, how to get more views, likes and share. So thank you very much guys to check out this video and have a fantastic time. Thanks.